Ladies and gentlemen, this amateur flyweight battle is set for five rounds at three minutes apiece. And it is for the interim B2 North amateur flyweight title. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. His record stands at three wins and one loss. His height, five feet, nine inches. His weight, 126 pounds. He trains with Inflow Martial Arts and comes to you from Mooresville, Indiana. He is your number five ranked B2 North flyweight contender, and his name is Jalen Mad Hatter McIntyre. And his opponent. Fighting out of the one more gym red corner. His record stands at five wins, one loss. His height, five feet, seven inches. His weight, 126 pounds. He trains with Immortal Martial Arts Center and comes to you from Columbus, Ohio, by way of Kailua, Hawaii. He is your number one ranked B2 North flyweight contender. This is the flying Hawaiian, Josh Pereira! First of two amateur title fights here in B2 Fighting Series 146. Your North Amateur Flyweight Championship is on the line. Jalen McIntyre takes on Joshua Pereira. Both guys coming out orthodox, heavy leg kick right away from Joshua Pereira. You know, ooh, I, I really didn't like how Jalen went down to catch that leg kick, man. Josh is going to see that and go high. He's, he's got it. You got to set these kicks up against Jalen, though, man. Jalen's no no slouch in this in the stand up department. Pereira reaching with a big right hand, using it to close the distance, and that's what he does. But Jalen knew this. Jalen knew he's got to be he's got to win here. If he gets him up against the clinch. He, he's got to be able to circle out and keep it standing. Watch for that overhand right again. Oh, See, barely missed right. that overhand barely right. Barely misses. And Pereira mixing it, up, mixing it up nicely here in the first round. Jalen's got to keep that left hand up. That overhand right's coming. It's like a dang missile. And he's going to throw it every time. He's going he's to use that to set it up to close the distance. It just feels like Pereira is meaner early in this fight. It's a he is mean. That's a nice looks, knee yeah. by Jalen. But he is. I mean, Pereira's just violent early on in this fight. You know, in talking with Jalen, while I was talking with his dad, his coach, Rob McIntyre, he said, man, you know, I told Jalen, it's fun to, you know, be in there and smiling and having a good time, but you got to start getting mean. Everybody else, you, you got to be mean in there. you got to go in there to kill. And, you know, that's what another thing Jalen has, has changed up in fight camp is the mental aspect of it. Yes, he's having fun in there, but he said he's going in there to kill. And used to, he just go. He went in there to have a good time. Pereira in on this guillotine. Yeah, Mac man, it, it's it's underneath the neck too. McIntyre's fighting the hands. Yeah, he is. Nice knee. Halfway through the first round. McIntyre tries to sit out on that guillotine attempt. He's got to fight the hands. McIntyre's in trouble here. Pereira's corner's telling him, hey, man, if it's not there, it's not there. Don't sit there and try to force it. And Pereira, very wisely, he's not, you know, trying to force this submission, but using it to hold on, keep McIntyre in place, and just land knees. Yeah, I mean, right there, and, he, and he's landing the knees. That one knee barely missed the nose of Jalen. Oh, that hit the eye socket of Jalen McIntyre right there. And another knee by Jalen McIntyre. That jab lands right there for McIntyre, trying to earn a little bit of respect from Pereira. But Pereira returns the heavy leg kick, and he's fainting as well. Oh, oh nice, nice side. Right that was nice. And they, oh, oh my God, the cut on Jalen McIntyre yeah, from that deep. kick is bad. It's deep. That is a horrible cut over the left eyebrow of Jalen McIntyre. Jalen's got to start countering these oh, legs. The big oh, the right, right lands from Pereira. Right. McIntyre in a world of trouble. But we've seen McIntyre cut yes. before. He, do, he doesn't care about that. Nice takedown by Pereira. And I knew Jalen, he's going to have to win this fight. He's going to have to keep Pereira from taking him down and staying in the dominant position. Ten seconds remaining in the first round. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if they stopped this fight at the end of the round, how bad that cut is over the left eyebrow of Jalen McIntyre. As you see the blood all over his face right there. Just, I mean, he's pouring blood right, out but, of his head. 
and you're right about that. It's in a bad spot, but it's in a spot that it's not it's not trickling in his eye. It's going sure. beside his eye. So that might be an overweighing factor on if the doctor is going to, you know, step, stop this fight or not. But like you said, it's a deep cut, Hacker. Yeah, it's a very deep cut. I mean, and that thing was all blood instantly, just a gash from the head kick there of Josh Pereira. And a, you know, the cut aside, a hell of a round for Joshua Pereira here in this B2 Fighting Series flyweight title bout. But what did we talk about? Jalen kept dropping the hands on the kick. Watch this replay right here. Goes for the guillotine choke. He knew it wasn't there. He's a smart fighter. Didn't try to pull it right here on this kick. Boom! Question Beautiful mark job. Kick. Yeah. Question mark kick. And McIntyre smiles, and they dap each other up. But it landed flush as oh, flush yeah. gets. And, but you know what, man? That don't surprise me that Jalen walked away or walked right through that kick. Here's the thing, though, man is that Jalen's got to start creating more angles and stay in He's got to be a little bit more active on the feet and start setting things up. And he's got to get his takedown defense. He can't sit there and let Pereira sit, shoot that overhand right and close the distance on him. He can't win this fight up against the cage panel like that. And I'm just looking right now. I'm, I'm trying to get a little angle. I can't quite see through to, to see the cut over the left eyebrow. I think that's a significant cut. And, and we'll see if Rob Mooney brings the doctor in or not. And obviously, I trust his his opinion over anybody's. And he's gonna have to bring the doctor in after the round begins, I believe. Matter of fact, I think every fight we've ever seen Jalen McIntyre in, there's been bloodshed. Right. But man, how good is Pereira? I mean, he's, he's a I savage mean, man. man. He is. He's just mean. Doesn't look like they are going to bring a doctor in. Okay. But we talked about in the first round when it started, Jalen dropping that left hand. Oh, oh he big right it. hand lands. Dropped but, that left hand. I know. Right away. Right away on the grabbed eye. his own eye. This could be a killer be killed round right now for Jalen McIntyre. That eye's hurt, man. It's he got bad. hit with that eye, and he, right. he did not like that and in, at all. In the first five seconds of the, of the round, he reaches up and grabs it. And Pereira's starting to get crazy. In the corner, and nice leg and kick. Right as Mac, and you see the, the legs start to buckle. It is, I mean, it looks, see the legs yeah. buckling right there yeah. when he's moving forward. Oh, that, you can't oh, quite see man, because that's of the bad. short, but we can see it's horrible. And Pereira's doing a great job of catching McIntyre circling to his left, and when that leg, left leg is planted, Pereira bombs it. Right, see look, Jalen went down to catch that leg kick again. What happened? He got question mark kick to the head. Right. That's what caused that cut. Pereira's gonna read that, man. And, and Jalen's got to stop circling towards that right side or switch stances one. Oh, oh big hook oh, kick. Big hook kick. Josh huge. Pereira in danger of finishing this fight. Jalen McIntyre hurt bad. Oh, man. And the elbows to the body. Jo Joshua Pereira going to town with the ground and pound. It all started with the spinning hook kick. And we talked about this. Oh, he talked about this yesterday. He said he's going to use them elbows to the body. Rob McIntyre's looking up tight to stop this fight. Jalen McIntyre. He's trying to fight. He's intelligent defense. Josh Pereira in on a 10 finger choke now. He moves it to the guillotine. It's in. It looks like it's in. He's the trying to get. saying that he might be out. No, he's still fighting. McIntyre's fighting tough, man. And th this is so tough. In on the ninja choke now. McIntyre's trying to fight it. He's thinking about tapping. His right hand's yeah, tapping, tapping, and it's, tapping. it's, over. it's over. Joshua Pereira wow. is your new B2 Fighting Series Amateur North Flyweight Champion in dominant fashion. Dominant performance, man. I've never seen somebody wreck Jalen McIntyre like that. No, Lord, no. Joshua Pereira is the real deal, man. And they need to get a stool for Jalen McIntyre right now. That kid is hurt. That leg's busted up. Legs busted, heads busted. I mean, he took a beating here tonight. He's only going to be better for it, of course. He will. But, man, what a dominant performance from Joshua Pereira. Did you see the spinning back kick right there? And McIntyre instantly hurt. Referee Rob Mooney, one of the best in the game, getting in on the action right away. That ninja choke. That, that ninja that choke was right tight. There. Hey, and man, that's that, it. that ten finger choke was almost tight. It, right. He almost finished it from there, but then transitioned yeah. to the ninja choke. Beautiful job. Well, and look, they call it spade a spade. Yeah, man. Uh, you know, Jalen McIntyre was, was in there having a hard night tonight. But he, I mean, he's loving it. Look at the smile on oh, his face. Oh, yeah, man. man, he'll be back. He's a dog. He's a dog, man. He's, I mean, he's going to be up at night thinking about this, how much fun it was. And Josh Forever's amped up to get that B2 Fighting Series flyweight championship wrapped around his waist. He ain't gonna have to wait much longer. Here is Lance Green for the official decision.
The two fighting series fans, your referee, Rob Mooney, has brought a stop to this fight. One minute and 25 seconds into round number two. Your winner by submission by guillotine choke. And new interim B2 North Amateur Flyway Champion, the Flying Hawaiian, Josh Pereira! Josh the Flying Hawaiian Pereira moves to sit six and one, and he is your new B2 Fighting Series North Amateur Flyweight Champion, as you see him there with the belt.